and I'm going to give you an example. A man dies. He leaves behind one son and one daughter. And he leaves behind 75, let's make it interesting. 75 million Qatari riyals, mashallah. Interesting. So the son gets 50 million and the daughter gets 25 million. And this, the, this daughter, is the closest relative to the daughter, male relative, is that son, my brother. Because she's not married, she, her father's just passed away, she doesn't have any other brothers. This is the brother. So now what happens? Islam says, listen sister, that 25 million is yours. You can do what you want with it. And this guy's 25 million, he has to look after his wife and children with it, and he has to. And on top of that, all your basic requirements, he must provide for you. Allahu Akbar, who has more money? Divide it. This guy has to divide his 50 million in five people, 10 million each. And that one, 25 million, I'm still sitting with it. And it's mine. 